Hi everyone, you're watching Surfstack blog and my name is Igor. Today I'll be telling you about our backlink analysis tool. In our previous video that you can watch here, we told you about rank tracking tool. Today let's talk about backlink analysis, another addition to Surfstack. Let's enter a domain and jump to backlink analysis. On the summary report page, you may find familiar metrics such as number of referring domains, number of incoming backlinks, number of referring IPs, and subnets of those IPs. We also show citation flow and trust flow. The first one shows the domain authority based on, based on the number of incoming and outgoing links. The other one shows the trustworthiness of the domain based on how closely it is related to other domains. Scroll down to see the graphs with information about backlinks over the last 90 days such as number of incoming links, number of referring domains, and the history of acquiring and losing domains. At the bottom of the page, you will find information about anchors. Now let's take a closer look at all of these reports. At the page of the referring domains report, you can see the total number of domains referring to you, the addresses of their websites, the number of backlinks they provide, their Alexa rank, and citation trust flow metrics. Now let's take a look at the backlinks analysis. It shows us... Uh, sorry about that, get the screen back. Okay, backlinks analysis. It is divided into two parts, new backlinks and lost backlinks. On the new backlinks report, you will see information about the donor URL, acceptor URL and their metrics such as trust flow and citation flow. On the right side of the page, you can see the link type and information about the time the link was first indexed and about the lost update on the link. If the link was lost, you can see information about it in the Lost Backlinks report. Let's take a look at that. Lost Backlinks report looks almost exactly the same, except for the part where we show you the date when our tool lost the track of that link. Now let's take a look at the most interesting part of the backlink analysis, the anchors. If you don't know what the anchor is, it's a text that is clickable in a hyperlink. In this report, you can see the anchor text the number of times it was used by referring domains and other data such as citation flow, trust flow, and so on. We plan to update this tool constantly, so stay in touch. Also, next week we'll tell you more about our site audit, another tool that we've added recently to Sorbstead. Thank you for watching, subscribe to our channel, and have a good day. Bye!